Hi again guys, Andy here from Awesome 3D Prints with another cracking little print for you guys. It's uh, only a quick one, so it doesn't take long to print. Um, and it's a fun, useful print that uh, you can use for storing cards and stuff in. As usual, I'll show you it printing and then we'll show you it being assembled and talk some more about it afterwards. And guys, as I always say, if you like my videos, give me a thumbs up. If you don't, give me a thumbs down. Drop me a comment as to what you did or didn't like. And subscribe to get more content and tick the bell icon so you get notified when they're about. Thanks for watching, guys. Right then guys, here we go, look. All come off the bed fairly well. Although the supports, some of them fell, which is why I've got these horrible stringy bits everywhere, but I'm hoping they'll clean off without too much of a problem. I think they probably will. So I'm gonna get rid of these supports now and uh, see what it's like when it's finished. Look at these weird bits of under extrusion. Just put a new nozzle and stuff on there, that's really weird. Oh well, anyway, I'll sort that out later. I'll uh, crack on with getting these supports off now. Right then, now all the mess is cleared up, let's see if we can get this thing assembled. I'm not entirely sure how this assembles. Obviously, I've got to make sure that this seats in the right place, otherwise... Otherwise it's not going to hit the bottom. That bit there, right, let's see. Clip that in roughly there. Now, sizing it up against the side here, you obviously want to make sure that this goes all the way down to the bottom. But there's still enough room to clip that bit on there. So if you put them next to each other, you can see that that's about right on the bottom and that's about right there. So I'm guessing, it's only a guess, that seat's about there if you can see it. So I'm going to put this one on as well. So like that, hopefully. And we just should... Now, these little white tabs here sit into a recess inside. So I might pay you to give it a little bit of leverage just to help it in there so you don't end up snapping anything off. Just a little bit. Just once you get past the first bit, there you go. That's it. And then as you open it, it says, Look at that, perfect.
It sounds a little bit rough at the moment. That's just because it's it's new and hasn't been used much. If I get some playing cards, I've got a certain popular card game here. Put those in. Perfect. Look at that. That's absolutely wicked. Ha! I like that. That's really good stuff. I love moving printable objects. I prefer printing play stuff that would just print like this and it works straight away, but even if it's some assembly required, that's really, really cool. I like that. Um, there is place for this one for little bit magnets you can buy. I haven't ordered any yet, but I think I probably will. I mean, to be honest, the weight of the cards keeps it fairly well shut anyway, so I don't think it's absolutely necessary, but hey, it's magnets. It's always good fun, isn't it? So I might order some of those. Um, but yeah, the guy, the guy that designed this has done a cracking job the way it works. I really like that. There is a, an older version of this, which I tried to print first, which I struggled with quite a lot. This has got a textured finish. Um, it's not actually my printer, though. My printer hasn't done a great job with some of the lines. I think I might have some issues somewhere. I've got to try and troubleshoot. But the texture finish is nice. The way the, the thing works as well absolutely wicked i really really like that that's a uh, quite a good thing to have this isn't just specific design for the game that i've got in here at the moment um it's i think it's designed more for the collector's cards that you can get uh, various different brands i'm not going to go into brands but um yeah certain kind of other games that you can collect and share cards with that kind of thing but it works really really well you could potentially resize it for different types of cards etc but that's it all finished another one i really like that and as i said previously guys if you like my videos give me a thumbs up it just lets me know what that i'm doing something right if you don't like them give me a thumbs down it lets me know that i'm doing something you don't like and if you want to see more subscribe and tick the bell icon that way you get notified when my videos are about anyway guys as usual thanks for watching hope you enjoyed it cheers guys